Okay, in this video we're going to look at how you sketch a cubic where there are three linear terms, however, there is a repeated root. Okay, so two of the brackets are the same thing. You've got this x plus 5 all squared. Now, in this case, what we're saying is, well, the cubic will cross the x-axis when x is minus 3 or when x is minus 5. Okay, so we only have two points where the cubic crosses the x-axis. We've got minus 5 and we've got uh, minus 3. So what does it look like? Well, in going back to is it a positive or negative parabola, you would have x times x times x. So it's x cubed, so the number in front of the x cubed is 1, which is positive. So you would start from the bottom left. But... Because um, in, you're going to have a repeated root at minus 5, the curve just touches the x-axis at minus 5 and then comes back through to 3, to minus 3. Well, okay. I haven't drawn this very well because it kind of goes back on, back on itself. Let me just try that again because I need the y-axis to be a little bit bigger. Going through minus 3, still not very good. That's a little bit better, okay? It's just so I need to get it crossing the y-axis. So, in doing so, it just touches the x-axis at that point, then comes back on itself to cross at minus 3. So it's crossing the y-axis at 3 times 5 times 5, so that's 75. Okay, I'm going to look at another example of this in the next video, just to uh, iron this out. 